While the slow cooker isn't just for chili and stews, it's good for desserts as well. We're in a kitchen with Joanna Cook, a.k.a. Mama Cuisine, a.k.a. Miss Good Food, a.k.a. Whatever Joanna Make I Wanna, a.k.a. Let's get to it right now. Let's Is that a good it. intro for you? I love it. Did that work? Every right. single time. That's we got a I great layout here, Mama Cuisine. We've got bread pudding in a slow cooker. Who would have thunk it? That's I'm in. Good. Let's do it. Let's, <laughs> Let's do, do it. it. Let's so do we it. have a couple steps here. Um, we have brioche bread. Which gotta have brioche. Is, gotta have that a on brioche. Deck. Sweet, buttery, super Making me easy. Nervous with that knife. Oh yeah, this is serious, serious knife here. Okay. We're just gonna put it in here. You think slow cooker is just for savory yeah, stuff? Yeah, like you that's what I'm saying. I usually do dinner stuff, like yeah. stews and stuff like that. You cook can some do. Meat. It's great because you want to cook it and just let it go. So you could do bread pudding in there too. We have some heavy cream. How much cream do we go with right there? Uh, is it just a couple cups. Like, Two. Okay, two. Two wish, cups. yeah. Okay. Egg yolks. How many? Two. Two. So bread pudding is all about it's rich. Yes. This is not a light dessert, right? So it's perfect for the fall too. And we have here some plums. You want to throw it in there for me? Oh nice. I get to be a part of the yes, team. Yes, of course. I like to get you involved. Now where do you so suggest plums. getting the plums? From the grocery stores? Grocery any specific store. place you like to get them from? Um I like to go, I'm in the northwest suburbs, so Valley Produce is really nice. I okay. like it over there. Um, but there's, you can get them anywhere. You okay. can get your stone fruit is really good with bread with bread pudding. Okay. So I really suggest that. And it's fall, so we want to do dried cherries. Dried cherries. Now, what if you wanted a different fruit alternative? Plums. What else would you Plums. suggest for somebody who's like, nah, not really a plum person? Peaches, nectarines. Peaches. Okay. Uh, we have some chunks, chocolate chunks right here for okay, you. Okay, so a little peaches and cream too. Yeah. I need it because you know that I'm a fiend. <laughs> Everybody know about that song, right? So funny. Mike P feels me. It's so funny. Yeah, Mike, he knows. I don't know. Okay. Sometimes sometimes he leaves me hanging on stuff. Like, we had breakfast the other day. He was 30 minutes late. I just can't count on a guy like I used to. I just don't know. That's hurtful. That's hurtful, Mike. So we're just going to pour it in here. Okay. See how easy it is? Super easy. Super easy. And then we're going to toss Get the ice cream. Do I do what, what, here, here, what do you want me this. to do? We want to stir. Yeah, I so we're just going to grab your spoon. Here, do it. Easy. Flip it. There you go. Nice. So, so we're letting it soak up in there. Yep. You want that, that rich mixture with That's the eggs it. and the cream. So easy. To get all in there with our brioche and our, and our fruits and in slow cooker. And then we're going to close it. Turn it on for like two, two and a half hours on high. Come back and the house smells amazing. So it's literally the same it's, as like throwing a piece of meat in exactly. there. It's the same principle. Same. Because it's a slow cooker. Same. And then that's what we have. And we wow. have some ice cream. You want to go ahead? All right. Are we both, let's both, let's yeah. both try this thing yeah, together, right? It. We're friends. We have some caramel sauce. And you said how long in a slow cooker for this bag? About two, two and a half hours. And that's the beauty of it. You can and you just can just go. leave. You can go, you know, yeah. run some errands, take the kids to the park, exactly. come back. Exactly. Come back and you've got oh, you're bread about to throw some caramel drizzle oh, on, I think. Yeah, baby. Here. Oh, you? that's what you do. Okay. Perfect. So, like, besides this, what are some other things you could throw on a slow cooker and I really up? love stone fruit in the slow cooker. Really? Because it's a little bit more hearty. It doesn't get, I guess, flimsy or mush too mushy. And you'll taste it here. Because this is on. Cheers. It's not mushy. Oh, man. Feels like the Bun. first time, John. <laughs> so That's good. Fantastic. So luscious. That's really good. Mm -hmm. Well, mm. <laughs> oh, give me a moment. That was fantastic. All right. Mama Cuisine, thank you so much for joining us this morning. For more simple family friendly re recipes, visit mamacuisine.com.